Thank you, Todd. Hello, my name is Chris Murray, and it's my privilege to introduce our internal analysis of Eastman Kodak. Here, we examine Kodak's current internal environment and discuss the organization's strengths and weaknesses. The internal environment consists of stakeholders, value chain, operations, marketing, ethics, and resources. Kodak is led by seasoned executives that made several strategic errors, bringing the company to the brink of collapse. Further analysis employing a BCG matrix shows that Kodak's primary cash cow is its business printing unit, and the company's dogs far outnumber any other category. The dogs include the one staple product of digital and functional printing. Kodak certainly has its weaknesses, including bankruptcy stigma, large liabilities, increased competition, and low penetration in high growth markets. However, Kodak has a number of strengths that may allow it to rebound from a disastrous decade. These include strong brand equity, intellectual property, and a legacy of research and development. Daniel is up next to discuss our SWOT analysis of Kodak, which focuses on understanding the relationships of strengths and weaknesses with threats and opportunities. Thank you.